We bought Superworm from a local pet store. This Superworm is very famous because they can eat and break down plastic. Once the worms are done feeding with plastics, so this is what it looks like, they create holes. Uh, we take out the microorganisms from their gut and we put them in flasks with fresh plastics so that eventually they start growing on them and degrading them. Our study is one of the few studies in this region to look at the microorganisms and plastic interaction in the marine environment. And with the ultimate goal to develop a novel bioprocessors for us to manage the plastic waste well. Those process can be uh, a series of reactions to transform these plastic materials into either monomers or the relatively small molecules that can be converted to something that is even more valuable. We have a big plastic problem and we need a sustainable method to take care of that problem. And we can look into nature, uh, let's say the superworms, right, and learn from nature, learn how the worms, learn how the microbes break it down, and then we can use this method in an industrial scale. And hopefully that will help with the recycling of this large amount of plastic that we have. to take care of our plastic waste crisis, we A, need to use less plastic, B, we need to shift to products that are more sustainable, like uh, coffee cups that we can reuse multiple times, and, and C, we need to increase our recycling effort. And for that, we can use the superworm, this natural method to use superworms, the microbes and the enzymes to recycle plastic. Jelajahi cara baru mendapatkan informasi. Download Metro TV Extend sekarang.